Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is Nicholas No H, and I'm here with another Vander reaction. So yeah, it's been a little minute, uh, a little longer break than I usually take, but I'm back. Uh, had a bit of tooth pain, but I'm trying to keep strong, trying to uh, get back on my daily schedule of reacting to music and checking out more Vanda. I swear, like anytime I go away or just try to, uh, you know, take a take a few day break, Vanda's making a new song, making a new music video. Like this guy's work rate is insane. Um, and he's always making quality. So I don't think he ever like rushes anything. It's just like he's so uh, used to making great stuff that he just puts it out continuously. Always has his mind, you know, going, always uh, being a true creative and, uh, you know, the king of flows. Yeah, can't wait to check it out. Um, I forgot what song I was going to check out, but I know some people told me to, that he dropped something new. So I wanted to check this one out first. Daddy Da and King. Uh, don't know what that means, but we're gonna be reacting to it. Yeah, shout out to all of Cambodia or you know Thailand Everybody that checks out uh, these videos and uh, if you've never been to my channel before I have a playlist of all my previous Vander reactions uh, There's quite a bit on there or quite a bit on the playlist already Also, I have a community tab that I try to update every few weeks You can see what's gonna be upcoming in the future um, and then also a patreon for any blocked reactions that I upload there for free and uh, yeah, let's get right to it. Enough talking. Uh, he always has longer music videos, which I always get excited about because it means it's going to be uh, kind of like, I don't know, it's always like a movie. It's either a movie or there's just so much action and, you know, fun stuff in it that it's really, really uh, great to see how his mind works and just uh, the type of concept or, you know, uh, theme he has going on in his music videos. So uh, let's get right to it. Three, two, one. Let's go. I feel like transported already. Yeah, in this like weird way, I was already like in a trance, kind of. I don't know. I love the visuals where it's like kind of blurry on some of the screen. <laughs> Those lyrics. It's so trippy. <laughs> Those lyrics too, wow. Okay, uh, trying to find a good place to stop that. It's, wow, like, this is way different from anything he's have he's had before. Uh, at least in my experience of, of my reaction to Vanda. I mean, kind of, like, it's, so this is, like, super vibey. It, like, brings you to a very specific feel a very specific like headspace that makes you kind of feel like tipsy in a sense or like high or just like not in the right frame of mind you're just kind of you know zoned out kind of slowed down um and i really like 
I like artists that can give you um, or that can bring you into that sort of zone. Uh, it's not an easy thing to do to, you know, production wise or with your voice to be able to, you know, kind of transport someone and make it feel like they're in another place. Uh, you know, sometimes songs are just uh, you're, you're very separated from the song you're listening to. You're just hearing it as, uh, you know, as music and it doesn't take you anywhere. So regardless if you if you vibe with this sort of music or you don't, it's still it's most likely going to take you to a certain place and I, I really like that um and you know personally i like i love this kind of type of music uh i don't know if it's my favorite from vanda so far because he, he's had so many great songs uh, more dynamic songs that you know are have so many elements and you know technical stuff uh inside of it but uh so far this is really really cool and i love the effect that it has and this music video is crazy i gotta say i'm i'm a bit lost with all the imagery and stuff like it, it seems like on one hand it's very uh modern and has like you know like i don't know like it's a sign of the times now and it's kind of like uh just uh, just what he's wearing and stuff is it seems more modern or like kind of it's like semi-futuristic but it also seems like very like medieval you know like witches and like game of thrones type of kind of like castle vibes uh at the same time so it's, it's just a mix of all these things like even at the, at the beginning i don't know if it's meant to have that feeling but it kind of the way the light shines down there's kind of like a pink He's, he's standing on like a little uh something that's it's pink and it kind of looks like uh the rest of him is like uh pitch black so it kind of looks like you know like the label in the middle of a, of a record or something like that like he's on like a big record um that's kind of the effect that i got from that i don't know i don't think it's trying to uh, mimic that but uh just his visuals are always uh very it's just something you can't really ignore and uh something that is always uh at the top of of at least in in the game that i've seen recently he Vanda's at the top of just visuals and uh, matching what you should feel in the song to what you're seeing on screen. Um, and yeah, this is uh, super vibey and really cool so far. Uh, can't wait to see the rest of it. Um, I wonder if he's going to switch it up because he usually does. But even if not, I just like this whole direction and, and uh, the vibe he's going for with this. Some damn like gator or something. See, I'm like bobbing my head, anticipating something, but... Like I'm in the inside of a lava lamp or something like that. There's so much like silence in the song that it's really amazing what he can do with that. Oh, this is part two, I guess. So two different songs. Okay. This already seems more uh, intimidating. All these visuals. I told you it's like a movie with this guy, man. He's. I don't know where he gets all this stuff in his head from. What's that instrument? That is a guitar? It sounds a little different though. Been 
Love that little pause. Yeah, I mean, that might just be guitar. It, it seems like some sort of string. It just sounds really cool. And if it is, I look stupid. I'm like, what is that? I love those vocals, you know, going off in the back as well. That statue's crazy. It's like a Mortal Kombat type of uh, monument, you know, dedicated to this, this, this king, you know? Wow. Wow, 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 wow. He's, uh, yeah, something else. Like, every time I listen to him, man, there's just a new experience. It's never the same thing twice. Um, you know, instrumentally, it's always different. Uh, Flow-wise, we already know. Like, King of Flow is that, that's kind of his moniker and what he is known for. He's never going to bring you the same thing and then try to take the easy way of, you know, giving you something that's popular and, uh, you know, milking that sort of thing and not giving you quality because he's always going to give you quality with you know the skills the the production the the music video the just the quality of everything as well as you know the flows and the lyrics and everything combined so i'm gonna have to listen again to these songs to figure out if i like them more than previous songs um on first listen i think his past songs resonated with me more but i think king really has a chance to be something super vibey for me that uh like i said that kind of guitar that string whatever whatever instrument it was just kind of set it off um, and both both songs are very calm in a way. Uh, it didn't really show his uh, like explosive, aggressive side, but at the same time, he didn't need to in these songs. This is like kind of the 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 kind of feel he was going for with it. And and Daddy Da, uh, it's just funny calling it that now, just because he's it's like he's referring it, you know, what the ladies call him or whatever. But yeah, I'm definitely gonna check out that that one again uh, in particular, just because um, I feel like in the right mind frame like when i'm not reacting when it's like you know three or four in the morning and i kind of just uh you know zoned out chilling um it's going to be the type of song that you know hits you way harder and kind of is uh you know there's certain times of the day or night that songs really are, are made for and i think that's what it's made for um but regardless uh it was a really cool experience and uh really like i said really fun to see all the different sides of him um and how he expresses himself uh just uh you know for all of us to see so great stuff once again um and yeah uh, if you do end up liking my channel and enjoy my content uh please consider subscribing it really does help and yeah i really appreciate it um if not appreciate it nonetheless and yeah uh, i'll see you guys in my next reaction peace